How you feel about that Dame trade? Finally choosing, well, finally getting a team to go to. I breaking news. I was shocked. I was actually shocked. Yeah, to yeah. be honest with you, because that's that team now. Like, what are you? I don't know. Hey man, it's his, his his life just became so much easier. Oh my god! I know. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't need to do all the work. I'll just stand in the corner and shoot spot up threes. Yeah, that that's gonna be a team to definitely watch this year because I, I I don't know. I mean, I wish he came here. That's the I thing. Really, really wish he came here. That's the messed up part. So there were reports a couple of days ago, basically saying that the Raptors are the front runners right now in terms of getting him over here. Yeah. So, and you saw what they were willing to give up because Pascal was going to be gone. Yeah. Uh, uh, Scotty was going to be gone. Mm-hmm. Um, it was a big... Hold on, did these guys know big, that they were going to be gone? Oh, buddy, the reports are the reports. Once your name's out there, like... It's a big shift. Sometimes and it never happened? They don't, sometimes they and it, don't know. And it never happened? It before. Never, it didn't happen. So what's the morale of the team now, knowing that, yo, you're about to be exactly. I And that's the part where a GM and a coach have to really come together and be like, yo... We still got to keep these guys up, perform, ready to perform. Because just because... How how do you feel as a player? It's business, yo. It's Mm -hmm. a business at the end of the day. You're nothing but a trading card. It's a number, huh? I mean, I feel like... Kind of like a regular job. Exactly. That's Mm -hmm. what happened with, like, Kawhi, right? Yeah, but it paid off. No, but... Yeah. Because Toronto's never really had, like, a superstar Mm -hmm. besides, like, Carter. Like, way back. Yeah. yeah. Well, McGrady too, but yeah. But I'm saying, like, you know what I mean? Like, someone that's, like, the big, like, the the go-to always. Mm. And Fair. so then, and we never really had, because, I mean, we were a great, like, player team, like, mm. collaborative, like, our six-man, like, our bench mob. Like, it was crazy. So, like, to do all that. But, you know, they always said, like, we need a star. We need a star. We need a star. And then that big, huge trade that happened when Kawhi came and DeMar left, mm. that was, that was, that was very... Time. That shook everybody, right? And then what happened? We won. So now with this, if he came, if Dame came and they let go, like that's what like I think like when like I feel like Masai is very like methodical. Exactly. When he, when he does stuff like that. I mean exactly. like people don't see like where he's going. Like or they don't understand it. So yeah, if like Scotty was gonna be gone pascal was gonna be gone and i don't know i think there's like two more i can't remember um and dame was gonna come like it 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 was um the it, shooter that they just drafted dick dick yeah. oh yeah see so that's <laughs> it. you just wanted to say dick i didn't want to i was hoping she'd catch on i know what i'm talking to. about number one dick yeah <laughs> shout out will His from the fan 590 mm. not like yeah I'm that one dick jersey was good bro. that one dick jersey that's supposed to be a hot seller you real like saying you've said I'm that like six times. Any, yo, if you're well, you just listen, say no, no, number no, one no, dick and no one said you know what you know why? No, because I'm like he wants <laughs> if, to keep going. He's if like you're that a, number one. Dick if you're jersey. a true Toronto man, you're gonna get your girl that one dick jersey. That would be the jersey I'm getting. Any girl that I'm holding onto my arm, one dick. That's all she's got. One dick, and it's someone else's. It dick. says in the jersey. Man, you're going to rap with <laughs> that one dick, yo. <laughs> Every Toronto man out here, if you're buying a new Raptors jersey for your girl, it needs to be that one dick. Anyways, right. okay, man. <laughs> Anyways, he's making some money off those jerseys, huh? I, that's all that it is, though. <laughs> but yeah, he was supposed to be part of the trade that went over there. Yeah. But going back to the whole Masai thing, Hadouken! the bigger play was getting Giannis here. That was last year. No, it's ne- you mean, it, it, there's a tr- it's next year, right? So there were talks about that last yeah, year. Yeah, I know, but Giannis isn't eligible to come here until next year, like yeah. to, to move. To be free. So if Giannis's plan was to come here, yeah. getting Dame now would right. have just been the well, but, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. Dame still has what do was it two or three years on his contract, three right? Years. Three three years on his contract. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So you thug it out for the two years right. until next year when Giannis right. gets here, or now we're turning up. Yeah. So Masai was willing to empty, take Every, it, yeah, yeah, take it all. Yeah. Because if I get Giannis and Dame, right, it's right, over for yeah, you guys. Yeah. But how these guys got Dame to go to Milwaukee? That's well, crazy to me. The well, Buck like star he he doesn't have to do anything. Like he Gucci, chill. but I mean, in he terms of chill. just yeah, they won the championship a couple of years, but Milwaukee ain't a friend. Like it ain't a big time city. And a star like Dame just came out of Portland, bro. Yeah, but we're Milwaukee, expecting to go. You we're expecting to see you at Madison Square Gardens now. 
Mm-hmm. We're expecting to see you in these big markets. You're going to Milwaukee, yeah, dog. The city, Wisconsin. No, but the team, the team. I right? guess you have to look at you have to look at it like that. So just go, you're going to win chips at right? the end of the day. Exactly. I guess. Like it's not about the city. Nah, do you him. think they're going to get it? Isn't that what it's about anyway, though? Nah, <laughs> it is until a point. Once you get one, you get paid after that. Shout out Fred. Mm. Well, I feel like you were gearing up to say something. They definitely have a chance. I mean, if you look at their roster. They still got Chris they, Middleton. And what they didn't give up. Mm-hmm. They still have Chris Middleton. That's like a problem and, in and itself. Chris Middleton now doesn't have that pressure of being the second option. Exactly. So Chris Middleton's going to play the role like how Clay Thompson played the role when Kevin Durant mm-hmm. was on Golden State. Mm-hmm. So he's just going to be sitting on the wing mm-hmm. waiting for one of the two to kick the ball to him. So it's easier. They still got Brooke Lopez, who's a solid defender. He can play in the post. Getting kind of old now, fans. but doesn't matter. Been a long time, but yeah, much yeah. is not demanded. Yeah, yeah, and Giannis is the type of guy that demands so much attention. Bro. The, Giannis isn't the greatest shooter, so all he has to do is continue to play in the post or barrel to the post, kick out, easy. They still got Bobby Portis, who is a big spot up shooter, or can be a spot up shooter, right? <laughs> um, they got Malik Beasley coming off of the bench. I mean, it's gonna be a problem right, for a lot of those so, guys. Yes, he has a question, right? Because I, I I don't watch basketball anymore. Yeah, knowing this is happening, mm-hmm. how do you continue to watch a Raptors game? Exactly. <laughs> it's Not like, exactly. I don't know. I can't. I can't relate to what you're saying right now. Because you're a true fan. I'm a fan of whatever team I put my money on. You're such a dick right now.